my gang and welcome to another episode of Mr. Ed Makes and in this episode I'll be making a hell lantern. So for this project you'll find a list of supplies that you'll need below. I start with the glass cylinder and give it a good clean and then I cut some faces off of skulls. You can get these at your Halloween supply store. You can find them online. Here's a video on how to cut the faces off if you want to learn more about that. So the next step is you want to mix up some gelatin. This is clear gelatin unflavored. You're going to put some really hot water in there, like boiling hot water. Give it a good mix until it's about the consistency of syrup and add your food coloring, a bunch of red, one drop of green, and that's going to give you a nice bloody color. And you just run that in there. And now the cool glass is going to cause that gelatin to set up right away. But you want to keep turning it so that it doesn't all run off and go down to the bottom. You want to get it all coated on the inside. So that's what I did. Within a few minutes it sets up and it's pretty much not going anywhere. And over the next few days it's going to dry and it's, it's going to get darker and it'll crack up and, and it looks really awesome and gross. So on this one not all of the surfaces got covered but that's fine when light shines through it it's going to make a really neat coat coating of light everywhere. You can see the texture of it with the light shining from the bottom. So I glue the, the faces on there. You can just go all out and cover it with faces if you want. I just put a few on here and I glued them down really, really well. Just weld those suckers on there. And for the sake of this project being simple, I, that's all I did was just glued, on, glued them on there and that was it. But you can make veins, put the gelatin on the outside, just make it look kind of gross and all scarry. You know, uh, have fun with it. <laughs> it's, it's really easy to do and a lot of fun. So once those skulls are on there, you pretty much have your project here. You can drop a lantern down in it, an uh, electric candle. Uh, you could put some battery operated string lights down in there, whatever you want to cause it to glow and give it that lantern effect, the hell lantern effect. So I hope you liked this project. If you did, be sure to give me a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe, hit the notifications, turn those on so you can be sure to uh, be notified when more projects like this show up. I have a couple more weeks of Halloween and maybe one or two more projects. So I hope you'll stick around for those. And as always, until next time, take care.